guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another episode of DIY with wine. For those of you who are new to my channel, I decided to create this like mini series or like a couple episodes of me doing my hobby which is like DIY crafts and other projects and things that just make my creativity to start flowing after a long and stressful day and to reduce nurse burnout and compassion fatigue I use art therapy as a way to heal emotional injuries increase an understanding of oneself and others develop a capacity for self-reflection reduce symptoms and alter behavior and thinking patterns and my hobby allows me to do that and because of vlogging is my new creative outlet i decided why not make a couple of episodes or videos me doing diy projects with wine in a couple episodes i'll probably do some with my friends but for this episode two i will be doing a painting for my bathroom and i don't really have a plan of what kind of painting i'm going to be doing i'm just going to paint something that fits with my bathroom theme so in my new apartment I decided that for my living room and my bathroom, they're both gonna have like this coastal beach theme. As I walk in the door, I just imagine myself relaxing at a beach. And then for my bedroom, if you haven't watched episode one, I did a tropical painting. For my bedroom, it's gonna be very tropical as if I am lying down underneath a palm tree. And it's gonna be a representation of Guam as well. Even though I've only lived there for like 12 years of my life, that's still my childhood and my home. So sit back and relax because it is time to uncork and unwind with crafts and wine. So for this episode, I have a blank canvas that I got from Michaels, not sponsored, but please sponsor me because I go to Michaels like almost every single day. I just love Michaels. That store has almost every craft thing that I need. And then I have these stencils. It has a seahorse, a seashell, and a starfish. Okay, so I'm gonna get started. This is Stella Rosa. Um, the Stella Pink is really good if you guys haven't tried it. If you like a sweet white wine, then this is the best one because I love white wine. I can't really do um, a red wine because I just don't like the bitter taste. I like when I drink something, it's sweet. And it's even worse when it's like a cocktail drink because I can barely taste the alcohol. You know, it's mixing with something else. First things first, I am going to take out the backing of the stencil. So I decided to add sand to my painting, so I'm going to bring out the yellow and the brown and figure out what color or how I can make the sand color. So I decided to add orange because I needed a more tanner color. I tried to mix a brown and yellow, but it looks like bird poop. So I went for a yellow and white. So I think the sand, sand, is coming together. I used a yellow, orange, and a white, but I'm already making a mess like I was painting and this fell down when I was mixing and it came on my shirt. I love the shirt, Boba is life. I do want to make a Boba painting. Um, probably gonna look up some ideas on how to do that because I'm bad at like drawing straight lines um but i think this is coming together it's hard to show you guys because of where the camera is facing i don't know why but when i did my first episode i actually did it the other side like i'm sitting there the camera is over here facing me and you guys can see it but here every time i try to show you guys the colors um you can barely see it but you can see that it's coming together. I don't know how far high up I'm gonna go, but I think here, and then I'm gonna do a little bit of white, you know, cause like that thin, thin white line um, as the water comes up to the sand is what I'm trying to go for. And then do the other colors going up. 
what's great about painting is like you can literally experiment and try new things. I think I did a little too much. From what I see in pictures, it looks to me that it's just the sand, and then I think what looks like ocean breeze color, it's like a teal, green, blue. And I can sometimes see this color, the island breeze, it's like a light blue color. So these are what came out with the uh, island breeze, ocean breeze, as you can see. really good. I'll add more of just Ocean Breeze by itself here and then Island Breeze with white and then Island Breeze with by itself and then maybe the dark blue. Um, I think so far so good. I'm going to start moving on with the Island Breeze color. As you can see. brushes that I have used in this video this one is by far my favorite because like the strokes on here look so good I don't know what kind of brush this is but this is what it looks like <laughs> pretty this looks so I am going to let this dry up and I will see you guys after I am literally running out of wine this is all I have left I don't think this will last me throughout the whole video I have another one it's basically like this but not pink Celebrosa Moscato di Asti so because my family are all cooking and they're home, now I am going to just start doing the stencil and I'm just gonna use gold paint because it'll be like a nice accent touch against the beach. Then I'm just gonna show you guys a quick time lapse of me finishing the painting and then showing you guys the final result.
so I'm obviously recording this on a different day than I did the painting. That is because I tried to record on my computer because my phone died before I was able to talk about my painting. The sound is really bad. I don't know why, but it's not even clear enough for me to even hear what I'm trying to say. But as you can see, I finished the painting. It looks really nice. The gold, I have to say, is a good accent color. And I like the way it shines off from the sunlight and the lighting. And I have to say that till next time, I do want to do more, um, especially for my living room. I don't know if this is going to be in the living room or the bathroom because now that I look at it, I think it looks really good in the living room, but I also was supposed to do this for the bathroom, so I have no idea. But also today, I went to Michael's um, and there was a clearance on the uh, summer decor and of course I bought pillows. I bought two pillows. They were on sale from like $24.99 to 480 and thank you guys so much for watching if you want to see more from me join my promosi posse by subscribing to my channel hit that like button on this video and i will see you guys in episode three